Hey folks, Nass here. Another episode of Medieval Dynasty in our Season 3 Challenge. Uh, let's see, so if you can see on the screen there on the right hand side, we've still got to do the Good Morning My Neighbors. Uh, we got to complete some quests for at least two more neighbors and successfully flirt. Uh, also, we have the Elwyn story that is ready to be turned in because uh, he just wanted us to wait to the next day. Uh, so we're actually going to go talk to Elwyn and, and do that portion of his story. And then what we're going to do is do the Unigoth story to where we have to go and talk to Dagobert. Uh, now this one here is where we're letting him know about the, the wolves and stuff that uh, we talked to Sambor about uh, in the last episode. So let's head off to Elwyn um, over in Gustovia. So I will see you folks when we reach Elwyn. Alrighty, folks, we are in Gustovia, and we are looking for Mr. Elwyn. Where is he at? Is he going to be in this hut? Right here? Maybe he's outside the hut here. Is this him? No, that's Edwin. Um, oh. Looks like you might be stuck there, buddy. Did you get in trouble? You got to stick your nose in the corner? I'm sorry. Alrighty, Elwyn. Alrighty, so now we got to deliver a stick to Dalebor. Alright, let's see if we can find... Oh, sorry about that, Olga. Uh, let's see if we can find young Dalebor here. Where is he at? He is going to be right here. Hi, Mr. Dalebor. How we doing? Oh, apparently I need to go grab a stick. Oh, look, there's one right here behind him. <laughs> Let's try this again. Hey, Dale Boar. Alrighty, there we go. We got Mr. Dale Boar his stick so he can pretend being a knight. Uh, let's see, an L1 just teleported out somewhere else. Uh, let's see. Oh, here you are right here. Mr. L1, come here, sir. There we go, Elwyn Story 2. So we've got to wait till the next summer to do another story with Elwyn. And let's go and check. Did that count? Yes, yeah, so the Elwyn Story actually counted towards one of our quests for neighbors, which is good. So then we're going to highlight this one here. Talk to Dagobert. Uh, yeah, we're going to head off to Dagobert. Let's see here. So as far as... Let me go back into this real quick. So as far as this one here, the successful flirting, we can flirt with anybody. But maybe if you guys could, in the comments, uh, give me an idea who you'd like to see uh, me ask to marry. Uh, who you'd like to see be my wife on this season. Uh, you guys just give me some suggestions down there and let me know her name and you know what little village she's in. Uh, if she's got good stats or even if the stats matter or whatever. <clears throat> Uh, but that would be a good little thing for you guys to to kind of let me know. Why, what's is everybody staring at the solar panel or something on the roof? What's drying your, your neck off? You hot and sweaty? I don't know. All right, let's head off to Dagobert. And I will see you when we get there. All righty, folks, we have come into Denica and we are looking for Dagobert. Actually, I have some stuff I need to sell. So let's head in here and talk to his wife. Uh, what is her name? Matilda, I think? Yeah. So let's talk to Matilda. How you doing, honey? Uh, let's see. So I've got 19 of these throwing stones. And... Ooh, I've got a flatbread from somewhere. I don't even remember where I got that. But anyway, let's see here. I've got 157 of these wooden spoons. There we go. That helps. So now we're not so close to being encumbered. Uh, let's see. I've got some flatbread and some meat and gravy on me. I'm going to need to eat and drink. Let's go ahead and drink. And two, three. Oh, we're at a 52 on our... Okay, we'll eat that flatbread. Sure, we'll eat that flatbread right now. 
There we go. Perfect. Alrighty, so let's go out here and talk to Dagobert. Hey, buddy. Buddy, come here. Dagobert. Alrighty. So we've got to go and chop down enough trees to get him 40 logs. Fun times ahead. Let's go chop down some trees. Hey, we got an extraction level. Alrighty, let's go in and do that real quick. Skills, extraction point. Uh, let's see, what do we got? Force of nature, so that's slower axe durability loss. Pickaxe and shovel durability loss. Uh, but we definitely want to get to this right here. Uh, so we can carry more weight. And it looks like you can actually place three points in that. So that's going to be nice. So we have to pick either this one or this one so we can actually unlock the next three. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick Force of Nature so it's slower axe durability loss. That way it opens up Mule. We can pick Mule for the next point. Alrighty, folks, we got uh, Dagobert's last four logs here. So let's give him his logs so he can make his palisade. Alrighty, there we go. Now we get to go talk to Matilda, who is, I think, going to give us a meal. She's going to be in the sewing hut here. There she is. Matilda! Alrighty, so what did she give us? Soup and potage. Nice. Good deal. Alrighty, so we got to go back and talk to Unigos. But before we do, I want to buy uh, some thread because we are going to be, whoops, wrong side. We are going to be making a bow real soon. Let's we only need one thread. I've got the coin for it. There we go. We got 18 feathers out of uh, chopping all that wood for Dagobert. And I don't remember how many we had back at the back at our village. I think we had like 25 or 6 or something. So we are on our way to being able to make some arrows and a bow. That way we can actually go out and do some, some hunting. Uh, since melee weapons seem to be a little funky as far as combat in the game. But anyway, let me head back to uh, Unigost so we can finish this uh, portion of the quest. I'll see you folks when I get there. Alrighty folks, we are coming back into Gustovia. I just went down and ran through the water since I was all kind of stinky. So let's see if we can find Unigost real quick and let him know that we had talked to Dagobert. Where's he at? Oh, he's just over here sitting on a stool. Well, pretty much all you do all the time, isn't it? Just sit on a stool. Alrighty, so talk to Unigost. Alrighty, there we go. Unigost story. He's been notified that Dagobert and stuff are going to be building their palisades to protect themselves from the potentially incoming wolf attacks <clears throat> but anyway we've got to wait for further events now so we've got wait till next summer on Elwen, and we've got to wait for further events on unigost and then all we have to do now is successfully flirt on chapter three uh so anyway make sure that uh you guys leave me some comments below um about who you'd like to see me uh, ask to marry me this season. Who you'd like to see be my wife. Um, we got two potential candidates down here, too. Two? Nope, nope, she's a little, little, little old for me, I guess. We got this gal right here. Let's actually see if we can talk to her real quick. 
Uh, let's see, 50%, new settlement, do you have a minute? Nice weather we're having today. Sure, let's go with that. Hey, she liked that, plus 10. Alrighty, let's, uh, let's get out of that. Let's do an F5, just in case it goes sideways on the next one. Uh, let's see, do you have a minute? Ooh, nice weather again. 20 approval from her hot dog okay let's go with four let's do an f5 again man that's awesome all right let's talk to her again oh we didn't get oh wait here we go let's see if we can get another one maybe uh let's see the field the noble okay no we we got her up to 70 i'm not going to take a chance on losing any points pushing it here uh let's see if we can flirt with her and get that out of the way today let's see Tell you something, beautiful lady. Sorry, but she did a uh, little young for me. How old is she? Oh, she's 30. I can't flirt with you anyway? Oh, okay. Well, we talked to her. How old is this gal here? Well, see, she's 54. Okay, yeah. See, she looked like she was a little older. But 30? Oh, okay. No worries. Uh, what we got? Oh, B, neighbors. Okay, yeah, there we go. Neighbors. It tells you a little bit about neighbors and stuff. Okay. Well, alrighty, folks, I think we're going to call that an episode. I appreciate you joining me for this one. And make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you hadn't already. Uh, feel free to check out the link to our Discord server down below. It'll be in the comments. Uh, and we will see you folks on the next one. You take care and happy hunting.